All right, welcome back, everyone. Uh, so we're going through Paper Mario. Uh, name's Eight Foot Gamer, and we're gonna keep playing. This is part two of the Let's Play series for Paper Mario. So strap in, and we'll we'll get started. Uh, my my back. Mm, what's that? That you, Mario? I remember a great crashing noise, and then the whole veranda collapsed, and I fell. Did you fall too? Just stepped out the door or into thin air, did you? Well, that was dumb. Well, we're both okay. The problem is, we can't get back home. Because that block's in the way. This block. This block shouldn't be here. Well, this is a problem for us. Yeah, a hammer? Oh, uh, of course. Where'd it go? I had it in my mouth, and I was using it to fix the veranda. So it's likely around here somewhere. Uh, I don't have hands, so it's kind of hard to hold onto things. Hmm. Nowhere to be seen. Guess it must have fallen somewhere over that way. Uh, Mario, we better go look for it. So we head over this way. And the hammer's got to be somewhere close by. It looks just like this. Look forward to bushes, my covered up. If a exclamation mark appears over your head, you can press A to search. I always thought it was funny, you know, if video game characters were real and that they actually said that in real life. Like, Mario would be like, "Where? I, why is there an exclamation mark over my head and what's the A button? So I'm just going to collect as much money as I can because money is great in this game for later. You found the hammer! Mario can now use the hammer attack. You can smash a yellow block with this hammer. Oh, there we go. That's it. That's a hammer. I'll wager that if you use a hammer, you can break that block and set it on way. You can also use the hammer to hit trees and make them sway. Sometimes stuff will fall out of it. You can use it by pressing B. Money! A lot more money. Money. Give me all the coins. You got a doll. A dolly. Oh well, I believe that dolly is Gumbari since she lost. You'd no doubt be overjoyed if you get back to her. So many people lose things all over the place, you know. Almost makes you feel like looking around everywhere. Intent. There's a lot of side quests in this game involving searching for stuff and giving it back to people or all sorts of things. Well, we found the hammer, so I guess we should head for home. Ouch! That wasn't very nice. Yeah, who are you guys? This is my playground, idiots. Nobody sits foot in here without my permission. Nobody. Prepare to be, uh, to start crying and to feed a master junior trooper. Mario, this is junior trooper. He's the boss of the neighborhood gang. A bit of a bully, obviously. He's more bark than bite. You can beat him easily. Just boost yourself up and don't take any lip. I'll stay right here behind you and watch your progress. So Junior Trooper here is um, fashions himself as kind of our rival. Um, you get to see him a lot in this game. Oh, excellent. Good move. Go on. Yeah. But this is the first gameplay that we get with both the hammer and the jump. It allows you to see and test out both moves right now. Both of them just do one attack power. Yeah, I'm just getting warmed up. Alright, you've almost got him. Keep it up, go on. Alright, alright, you asked for it. Say hello to Junior Trooper Special Attack. Full power! See, if he had done that at the beginning, I would have actually been in trouble, but... Not this time. 
My God, that was wonderful fight. You got some star points. You get star points every time you beat an enemy. Every time you save up a hundred star points, you'll go up a level. Always try to get, uh, try hard to get points. Shoot, I was winning too. I'll be back, Mario. Uh, I mean it. I'll be back. N not like just now. I'll I'll be back later. Now we can use the hammer to get all sorts of things. Like there's things hidden in trees. We can use it to break blocks, but it won't break these gray blocks, not yet. I have to get a better hammer. I want all the coins. Got item. Heads up, Mario. I see bad goombas ahead. They're loyal to Bowser. If they see you, they'll attack you without hesitation. If you can successfully attack an enemy in the field with a jump or a hammer, you'll get a first strike when you enter battle. Strike at first really helps when it comes to battle. So we're probably not going to watch all of the battles that we do here. We'll skip over them, unless something meaningful happens or if it's a bigger boss. But for the most part, it's pretty easy. Here at the beginning especially. They don't want you dying before you get back to where you're supposed to. One quick note, though, some enemies do have defenses that give them either a better attack against you or can make it so you can only attack in a certain way. This guy has a spike on his head, so we can only use the hammer. This guy here is flying. You can only jump on him. Like I said easier, uh, earlier, a lot of these fights are super easy. Usually when there's only one guy that you're fighting at a time, it makes it super easy to just breeze through it, get a first strike, and move on. So what we just collected there was called a star piece. Uh, there's a lot of collectibles in this game. Um, Star pieces, coins, items, badges, which we'll going to hear about in a little bit. Never worry, kids. I'm here. Thanks to young Mario here, I made it back all right. Oh, is that thing off? Let me open up for you. Gilpa, where have you been? I looked outside and, well... You, both you and the veranda were just plain gone. Goodbye, I'm so very sorry. Uh, I was very worried about you. Really worried. Sorry, kids. I apologize. Didn't mean to make you fret. Uh, you just take it easy now. I'm back safe and sound. Now, before I forget, I decided to give you some Mario. Wait here a minute. Hey, that doll you've got, that's the one Gumbari lost. She was looking all over for it. Would you get back to her? Eh, yeah, sure. I don't want to hold on to it. It's my dolly. Dolly, dolly, you're back. Thank you so much. I'm so happy to see dolly. Don't you ever get lost again. Uh, here's a present for me. Look at the pretty glitter. Okay. Star pieces. We'll go over those, what they're used for later. And take this too. Ooh. Goomba kisses. Yeah, you always seem to beat up your enemies, don't you? Uh, do you work out? Uh, I, I study self-defense by reading books by the masters and listening to Dad and Goomba. Uh, and I exercise every day so I can be strong like you. It's starting to show too. I'm getting big muscles on my head. Yeah, Gumbari's head is so hard, it's as, a, it's as hard as a rock. Tee hee hee. Uh, when he does his head bonk move, it really, really hurts. Oh, be quiet, Gumbari, you're embarrassing me. Uh, of course it is true. 
Sorry to keep you waiting, Mario. Uh, it's okay, Goomba. We were just rapping with Mario. Oh, rapping, huh? I'm sorry, I wanted to give this to Mario. Power Jump Badge! This is called a badge. If you wear this, you'll be able to do a power jump, which means you'll be able to do a lot more damage with your jump attack. But listen here, listen well, you won't be able to do it if you're wearing that badge. You better try it first. Yeah, blah blah blah. Just remember you need power points to use this power jump technique. Yeah. By the way, Mario, I heard from Guma. You're taking upon yourself to try and rescue the princess from Bowser's clutches? Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, Mario can beat Bowser with one hand and tie it behind his back. Hush now, you Mario. Mario, please take this hand. It should serve you well. If I were just a bit younger, I'd accompany you on your trip. Might have done some damage. Well, gotten damage now, though. The years have started away on me, though, and I'll tell you, this lower back pain. Adventure? You're so lucky. Princess rescuing is so cool. I always wanted to be an adventurer, too, someday. Me too! Oh, here's an idea, Goombario. Perhaps the timing is perfect. You're no longer a child, and evil times are upon us. I'm sure Mario would agree. You, you should accompany Mario. What? Really? May I go? Goomba? Really? May I? Yes! Oh yeah! Mario, you won't regret this. I, I didn't say you could. I mean, you can. Just don't be a bother. Make sure you bring snacks. Way to go, Goombario! Mario, I know Goombario will uh, prove to be a worthy companion. Well, it's time for a nap. I'll be in the house. Goodbye, so have a way of making you go uh, get a wee wee. This is so cool, Mario, let's go! But wait, eh, blah blah blah. We'll go heal up. I want a nap too. There's a few things here that we can pick up, I think. Maybe here? Coin. Didn't We'll go ahead and save. And let's go ahead and go. There we go! Problem solved. I had a feeling your road would be lined with difficulties, so try not to overdo it. Be watchful, yet stay cool. Always a calm mind is the wisest. I want to hang out, Mario, blah, 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 blah. Right, so this is how you put on badge. So on this pause menu, you've got um, different sections telling you what your items are, who's in your party, you know, you get to see the map, things like that. So we're going to go to badges. We're going to turn on the power jump badge. Um, down here, you can see that we've got badge points. Uh, those badge points tell you how many badges you can equip. Each one, each badge can be worth, you know, um, zero points or ten points. I, I don't know. Um, but uh, the more powerful the badge, the more badge points are needed to use it. And you can only equip so many as you've got badge points for. So, we'll start off with this one. I'm going to give myself a bit of a handicap. If I haven't seen an enemy's health, then I'm going to use my ally here to tell me what the health is so you guys can see what it is. More coins. That's really what I'm after.
Hey, 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 hold it right there. You know, yeah, you suspicious guy. Don't move. Ah, you're Mario. I knew it. You can't go past here, Mr. Big Shot. It's a direct order from King Goomba. That's right. I'm sorry, but the only way through is the Goomba Bros. That's me, Red Goomba, and my brother, Blue Goomba. Let's get him, Blue Goomba. Oh yeah, let's do it, my red brother. So, we got a fire flower earlier. I'm gonna go ahead and use it. Save us a bit of time on this battle. And you can see how items work. Items can be used to heal you or to attack the enemy. Go ahead and get their health going. Mario, how'd you like some of this? Bl Blue Goomba! Blah, my little brother, you'll pay for that, Mario! And still a pretty easy battle, but lots of XP points. Star points. Yeah, I'll let you go for now. We'll see them again. Let's go back and heal real quick. Because we have another boss battle coming up in just a minute. It's usually why you see a health block and a save block. This is always fun, just to bounce on the spring. So this one is a trap. I'm just gonna go ahead and ignore him. Because we are really after the big man here. Yeah, King Goomba, help us! Mario beat us up! Uh, hey, look, Mario. You see that building over there? I'm pretty sure it used to be a bridge on the other side. What what happened to it? Yeah, it's a fat, ugly Goomba. Isn't the show? This is Mario True. Uh, it's true. Uh, you made it this far. I respect you for that. Unfortunately, this is as far as you'll get. Because I, the great and powerful King Goomba, will see to it that you advance no further. You see that, Mario? No further. Not a step. Are you scared, little man? <laughs> I'm, uh, yeah, you're scared, all right. Uh, you wanna say you're sorry? Wow, that King Goomba is really huge. Uh, I'm sure he's no match for you, though, Mario. Let's get him. Did you meet my wrath, Mario? You better be. Uh, beat him up, King Goomba. We got you back. Leave him to me. Hey, hey, Mario, I think we ought to take out the Goomba Rose first, don't you think? It's pretty weak since their last fight was just barely. Oh yeah, they only have two health. Let's go ahead and get some info on the king here. So here's a neat little trick. You can actually attack the tree. There's this big old nut. That'll drop on all three of them. Hey, 
And again, this is going to be a pretty quick battle. But then again, it's the prologue. And the end. And a level up! So, I'm gonna say hearts, they're useful later. Right now, I think flower points are the biggest bet that'll help us kind of speed up the game a little bit by allowing us to use badges and, you know, moves that cost a little more, more frequently. So, we're gonna go ahead and do this. How could I lose? Yeah, I knew you could do it. Cool. Victory! Yeah. Goomba, you're positive that you hit the switch. Well, right. Of course, King Goomba. I hid it in the grass outside the fortress. Outside the medium? We didn't hide it in here. Mario will find it for sure. Uh, oh, you, you think? You know, you might be right. King Goomba, maybe we ought to try to trick Mario before he tries to... I'm just going to go ahead and press the switch. Because, I mean, who doesn't want to press the switch, right? Do I jump on it? Yeah, let's jump on it. Uh, Mario, good, good fight and all that, but I must warn you, however. If you happen to find a strange switch somewhere, do not, uh, you should definitely not press it. It's dangerous, understand? You what? You already pressed it? No! <laughs> How do they make a, a single switch do all of this? Whoa! Look, the bridge! Now we can cross it and continue on our journey. Alright! Let's see if there's some money or other things to grab here first. Yeah! Nope, no money there. Put it back here. Super shrimp. All right. It looks like that's all that's over here. So, let's see where it takes us in the next chapter. And I think that's where we're going to leave it. I really hope that you enjoyed this video. Um, if you do, please leave a like down below and, and make sure to share it and uh, subscribe if, uh, for more content. I mean, we're going to keep going with this and I hope that you guys enjoy it and that you're having fun. I am having fun. Um, it's really fun for me to play through this game. I, I really enjoy it. And um, Anyway, that's all for now. Ciao!